gonna talk about. Wait, I want to ask you something. What were you about to say? What happened? Your your office almost burned down. Yeah, bro. Yeah, so check it fuck, out, bro. man. Yeah, I think I almost blew the podcast. <laughs> listen, listen. A couple of days, I had a, a a long ass day. I'll just share it with y'all here on the show. So like, um, I had got in my car uh, taken from me on Sunday. Uh, cops pulled me over. Not supposed to be on the road. So they went ahead and gave me. They took my whip. They were, really? No, the crazy part is. So they got me for speeding, Finally right? Caught you. I, yeah, it's been a year, so I could accept they got me for speeding, right? But they, the cop was trying to tell me that I was faded. I was drunk and I had not drank that whole day. I was sober as can be, didn't smoke. It's, and I had to go back and forth with the cop. He did a should, sober test on you me. should have been like, I'm just a silly ass nigga, bro. My I was going to, Blasi, uh, you Seriously, have this like, like you the do way, have high. The way, energy. yeah, the way you like, even when you're sober, like the way you talk and everything, like I would just assume you're high already. Like, I don't know what it is. You have high energy. High I'm perma fried. Yep. No, nah, I don't think you're perma fried nah, because you're either. like smart, intelligent, you're smart and productive. Fuck, bro. I'm but, just a smart stoner, but, but look, the cop was convinced and I kept telling him like, bro, what are you talking about? I don't drink alcohol like that. It was like, I was like, I just let my mom's crib, right? So I'm telling you, you want me to call my mom? He's like, you're an adult. Why would you need to call your mom? And I'm like, oh my fucking God. He's absolutely right. Yeah. But so he starts See, but that's, that's some shit a high nigga would say. So he starts doing mm-hmm. the sober test. He, yeah. do, he, do, he does the test where he kind of gives me a light show and shit, tells me like, oh follow my and don't God. move your head. Yeah. I performed that with ease. And then he, he's still a little upset and I'm giving him pushback, bro. This motherfucker tells me, uh, um, I don't know if you had a Michelada cup earlier. Wow. wow. That's what he said? I swear to God. I mean, oh. it was a Mexican cup. Uh, uh, hey, wait, uh, wait, 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 wait. Brown what, on brown. Was it a Sunday? Yes. It's a, that's very fair then. <laughs> that is so he fair. Also said that the that's, the, that's the most no. fairest thing ever. That's why I asked. He yeah. also, if it was a Sunday, it's a, that's a but fair he, question. He also said that the cop was Hispanic too. It's brown on brown. It's super fair. Brown on it brown was a crime. Sunday too? Yeah. He was in fair. his brown. Hey, he was in his brown bag. Mm. Damn. Out now. So so pretty much, bro. He's oh, upset no. that I'm giving him pushback because all, all leading up to this, I'm quick with the answers. Yeah. I'm being cool, calm, collective. You know, but everything's he's great. He's, he's gonna be his own lawyer. Oh if yeah, I, that's true. I've been my own lawyer. Check well, it out. Really? So look, How does that work? Hey, I'm already done with this shit. You know, I'm not even kidding. But look, so he he he. It goes from giving me a ticket to escalating to like, nah. Now I'm taking your whip, and you're not gonna get this shit till ABC. So. Because this you, shit happens to me, right? But I have like this paperwork for my DUI shit that I have to turn in because I had court on Wednesday. It gets deep, bro. So now I got to get my car out the impound to get this paperwork so I can present to the judge on Wednesday morning. It's yeah. Tuesday. And every day your car's in the impound, they charge you they a daily yeah, fee. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So I got it out on Tuesday, but I had to go from 10 a.m. They told me, go to the East L.A. Police Department. They'll help you. I go to this random one at the park, like on First Street in Atlantic. <laughs> They tell me go across street to the sheriff's spot. Go to the sheriff's spot. They're like, no, we can't do this here. Go to Hill Street. Go to the God, court. I, I go that, to the bro. court. I'm at the clerk, right? Like, no, the, the cop hasn't even imported your fucking ticket into the system. Oh, I'm my. like, what? And I show her the impound ticket. She's like, oh, no, you're good, though. Go to the uh, impound. This this is irrelevant to what you got going on. I go there. They're like, nah, you need the paperwork. Oh, I go to CHP my now. God. Are you bro, joking, bro? It's like 2 p.m., right? <clears throat> I go to C- I swear to God, this is my Tuesday. Are you Ubering everywhere at this point? I Ubered half of it. My assistant drove me the other half of okay. it. The, oh, the first crazy, three bro. spots though were Ubers. And I'm like, I can't, like, I thank God that I have a support system that could drive me around because I don't know how someone could do it on the bus. That would have been like 500 that, bucks in Uber. You know, yeah, for sure. So they, uh, bro, um, crazy, so now I'm at bro. CHP and now the agent, like, he's brand new, bro. And he's telling me, like, uh, no, no, you're at the wrong spot, you know? And I'm like, no, it's his agent. Because I already learned from all the other clerks. I'm like, no, you need to approve it. It's his agent approval. So he goes up to a supervisor three out like an hour goes by. He's like, well, you need to have an ID. Who's going to drive your car? I grabbed Chris out that shit. Now we go back to the impound <sighs> and they're like, but you shouldn't be driving. Why should we give you the car? And I'm like, Jesus what? Oh, I'm like, are my you friend, because I had Chris, Chris was doing his own shit when he dropped me off there. And are I'm you like, joking? you know, he's going to park across. And at the end, she's like, don't worry, mijo. I know you're just going to drive. And oh, I was like, mijo. and to top it all off, this paperwork for the DUI shit wasn't even in my car. It was in my fucking office. Oh, my. So all this hustling hus- wasn't worth it. This hustle and bustle. And in the middle of this shit, my fucking office calls me saying, bro, the trash can's on fire. Where's the fire extinguisher? Oh, this trash can is sitting right next to my fucking smoking cart that has nothing but fucking butane tanks this shit was gonna explode How? i watched it on the security cameras there's flames uh but someone here accidentally God, uh emptied out uh like a hot bowl of weed into the fucking trash can this is like one of those utility those like yeah. gray trash cans they're about like two feet tall or whatever Bro. and uh they were able to take it out with water like that's risky as fuck but like Did i you- had a rough tuesday and then you know wednesday morning i pulled up you feel me and they told me you're all good you feel me just take your classes now I got a real bro. license. 
bro. I got my whip back. I'm chilling. Let me ask bro. you this because I, I have a homie. Who, but that was my last couple of days, bro. That's, that's the crazy. That sounds, that sounds like a rough. shit show, bro. One of my homies is going has gone through two DUIs already, right? And uh, yeah, maybe he, he should just stop driving. And he told me worst date I ever been on. <laughs> and <laughs> literally, and bro, he told me like, dude, if you get pulled over after they take your license away, it's like you basically like take you to the take they, you to the station. He like, could a big deal. Yeah, no, he could lock me up. I have like suspension. Oh yeah, yeah. Dude, like the whole time that y'all know me, I was driving on a not. I remember. License. I and every suspended. time you said that you were on the freeway and your tire popped and all that stuff, yeah. I was like, I was worried. I was well, like, one thing I learned about like the LA County real. police is like they're so not interested in putting people in like behind bars right now. Bro, they no. understand how no. packed it is. Driving. No, it's kind of twisted. You could kind of no, like listen, I, listen. I hate to He's give so this. Right. I hate to give this information, but it's like no, it's you know. True. I told my mom because I'm so worried, right? But mm. it's like, mom. If a cop pulls me over, I mean, I'm living an honest life. I don't have a fucking dead body in my trunk. Yeah, yeah. No, Sorry, fact. officer, I got to go to work. Or, you know, I was dropping off I my mom God, or whatever it I is. I swear to God, bro. And usually let you go out, you know? Bro, I'm not going to lie to you. Okay, so like I said, in that two years, my license was fucked up the entire time, right? Mm -hmm. But, like, it started off like I was only driving the car to literally do errands for my mom at first. And then once it got to the point to where I'm, like, you know, out and, like, Going running from A to B, myself, you know, just going from A to B. Like I, I only got pulled over a couple times, thank God. But on the times where I got pulled over, I literally was like on the way to no jumper or something. And I yeah. like let them know, like, yo, like, I'm on the way to work, blah blah blah. And honestly, if you just keep it real with them, especially bro, with traffic shit, bro. If you keep it real with them, they really, nigga, I've never got the car towed. Yeah, I never got the car towed not once by the police. I'm not gonna lie, I've never been in a car with you. How you driving? But you drive like a no. This wild nigga drives crazy no. as fuck. Are you joking? You drive I don't. That's crazy. why you just got a speeding ticket, bitch. But you the, drive crazy. The, the, both I got of your cars are ticket. dinked up. Like Listen, crazy. I didn't get no collision ticket. I don't mean to yell. I didn't get no collision ticket. Mm. Like one bitch, thing about that's not a thing. Hold on, hold on, hold on, <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'm gonna glaze myself, man. Listen, <laughs> like my whole thing is like, it bro, sounds so gay. I'm gonna glaze. You play some Rilo. I'm behind the wheel. Nah, you'll be relaxed. I'm playing leapfrog. You ever played that game? We gotta go in between the cars. That that's me. Not okay. Yeah, no, that's no, not. He okay. literally not does okay. that. He, not I'm okay. that guy on like those like Instagram reels. That's like no, no, no. no. You know that no, doesn't no. help, right? No, no, no. You know who Blazzy is? You know when that guy he's driving and he's like rapping, rapping his song or whatever. And oh yeah, like, and things are started from the bottom. Now we way, <laughs> up, way. Up. That's you, bro. Bro, and he's like shirtless. Up, he's like shirtless. Like flying by. He's shirtless, rolling up a blunt, that's rapping me. the lyrics, going like 80 miles per hour. No, he's going like 150, <laughs> bro. <laughs> One thing about me, I, I love that clip, bro. Hold on, because honestly, started like, from that bottom. I want to be, I want to be in his car, bro, because that no, you that you vibe don't. is impenetrable, bro. That vibe of just impenetrable or impenetrable. Listen, bro, my whole thing is I'm so I'm so <laughs> NBA. If all this shit goes left, I would love to be a driving instructor, bro. I love telling people how to drive. Started from or the bottom, a NASCAR, now we way up. or oh. a NASCAR driver. Hey, they're gonna drive you be like driving that. like a NASCAR driver. You could be a I'll, demolition derby like teacher. No, and then you got these extra. Out, then he has these extra out ass speakers where like the bass is boosted like times a million. Yeah, and as soon as he fucking throws dun, on the little baby or the fucking Kodak, is a wrap. Like yeah. it's a wrap. I he's punch, taking you. He's taking you on a fucking. I punch the gas excursion. <laughs> Bro, I you, can't wait to. Hold on, I'm not even gonna speak like you that. You should not drive like that, dude. That's not okay. 